and a house built from waste that could be a home for the future. Forget bricks and mortar. Imagine a house made with sand, cans and tires that will help you reduce all your bills. With energy prices so volatile and the rising cost of housing, many people are now looking at green alternatives to traditional homes. Our Canada correspondent Daniel Lack has met the owners of a new type of home that costs little to build and even less to maintain. More than a house, Craig Cook is building a dream, a self-sufficient environment that once complete will cost Craig and his wife Connie next to nothing to run. It will feed you. Solar energy warms the stone interior and keeps things cool in summer. The walls are 1,200 old car tires filled with sand. A wind turbine charges batteries and wastewater is recycled through an indoor garden that provides fruit. The cooks, retired in their mid-50s, have done almost all of this on their own. Absolutely. It, it's yeah. every step we take, it's just, you know, we step back and look at it and think this is amazing. We can't believe, first of all, that we've done it ourselves. And it just, everything that takes shape is just so exciting. This here also, I mean, anybody can do this. Absolutely anybody. It, uh, you know, it, it takes care of its own Sewage. Okay. The Cook's architect specializes in sustainable homes, which he says are catching on as Canadians watch energy prices grow and contemplate a future without bills to pay. I really like, therefore, the idea that the house is heated by sunlight. You know, that's wonderful. Oil or gas is sunlight from eons ago, right? And, uh, but why not use it directly as it uh, lands on us? Of course, it's hard work, years of labor, and collecting the recycled materials. The total cost a little over $50,000. The cooks are already living in the house and discovering fresh enthusiasm from the reactions of visitors. All the people that come in and are excited. They walk in and go, holy mackerel. You know, I mean, that, that gives you energy to know that you're doing something that excites other people. Powered by the wind or the sun, warmth and cooling from natural sources and built largely from things that are thrown away. In a time of economic uncertainty and climate change, this could just be the house of the future. Daniel Lack, Al Jazeera, Clear Creek. Now, imagine a house made with sand, cans and old tires that helps reduce your bills. With energy prices and housing costs rising in many countries, people are looking for green alternatives to traditional homes. Algiers' Daniel Lack met the owners of one such house in Clear Creek, Canada.